Hey everybody, this is Shock, and this is another edition of Shockbox. What Shockbox is, is where I go into my YouTube email here, and I'll read some of the emails that you guys send me. And um, we just started doing that on a whim, and people really enjoyed it. So before I read you some of these really good emails, um, don't forget to go here to this top website here, shockonnow.net. And when you get there... Um, I'll show you a couple of good things that you should get for free. Go over here to the right and click own a chat room. And when you click it, this page will pop up. This is totally free. And you register right here. You fill in those two slots with any name you wish and any email you wish. And you will have your own conference room, your own chat room. Another thing you guys should do is click links right here. When you click links... I highly suggest you scroll down here and read this right here where it says um, proof of God and it is excellent um, I actually it says yet even more proof of God so click that and what I want you to do is go through this and read these different uh, proofs and evidence of God and I've had four people four people just recently this week leave atheism and become Christians and so it's excellent now some people are right on the edge of uh, becoming a Christian also so um, let's read some of those emails and um, here we go <clears throat> first of all <clears throat> here's a guy he says hey man been a fan of your channel for a while I decided to make a brand new channel now the reason why is he used to be an atheist right and he says, anyways, I recently left the cult they call atheism. I was asked at your chat, and by the way, if you guys want to chat with me, when you go to shotgunnow.net, click go to chat. And this is what he's talking about, because he came in and he said, hey, I left atheism and I'm a Christian. And um, he said, I was asked at your chat, what made me leave? He said, well, I looked at the argument some of these cuckoos were spewing, like the atheist experience, for example. I then realized how immature and foolish atheism was. Nothing about atheism makes any sense at all. They can't argue for it, so they mock other religions, mainly Christianity, by making up stupid religions of their own, like Pastafarian, for example. About half of the people I knew were atheists had Santa syndrome. The others that claimed to be atheists were big fans of Aleister Crowley, and his book of law, which is a whole nother load of BS that is full of Satan. Anyways, I found God again, and I have never been happier. Keep up the good work, sir, and you got some backup coming. I got about 500 questions I want to ask some of these people. Amazing Atheist makes wild claims such as the Bible promotes violence toward women, which proves he has never even read the Bible. What's sad is his subscribers eat up every word. No worries, my friend. The fight is far from over. More people can and will be saved. God bless you. And keep making those great videos. So <clears throat> that's excellent. And here's another one um, where he says, I was in your chat room today. We were arguing. And by the way, if you guys want to go to chat, click right below here and it'll say chat. We were arguing with an atheist named Cypher Thinker. He was convinced that it was our job as a Christian to make him believe in God. That was his argument. It was ridiculous. There was another Christian there who kept bringing up evidence and all he did was shoot it down with his Santa syndrome mindset. <laughs> the funny thing was though that he didn't even bring forth a shred of truth to support atheism. It was amazing. It only furthered my faith in God. This is what happens. And this person here says, funny story about the madness of atheism. My friend shared something amusing with me earlier. She was telling me about how Another one of her friends was debating with an atheist on Facebook. And the atheist was asserting that when we die, we become trees. We, <laughs> I, could, I could not stop laughing. He says, I cannot stop laughing. Then I remembered you and your mission of shedding light on the madness of atheism. Just wanted to share this story and a laugh. Okay. Uh, this person says, a believer and a bad company two player. You, sir, are my hero. Um... This person says, the last few weeks, I've been knee-deep dealing with atheists here on YouTube and Yahoo's messages. Understanding them better, I feel I have to study them. The sick feeling I get reading 
made me feel sick to my soul. Then I came across your YouTube site. Ah, uh, I felt clean again. <laughs> and this person says, um, this one's not really a positive one, but they're coming around. He says, basically everything. Thank you. At first, when you subscribed to me and I was getting notifications on your videos, stuff like that, I thought, this is crap. There is no God. Eventually, I started watching the videos you posted. They're really something I enjoy to watch. And I love the video where you slam that guy with the question. I mean, I know nothing about the Bible. I don't really know about atheism. My family grew up Catholic. And since my dad works out of state, my mom does shift work. And he says, whenever we had time to go to church, I never learned about God or anything. You're one of the things that makes me really want to read the Bible. Um, yes, we do make it very interesting. This person says, you're the greatest. Before I had little faith, but you have shown me towards the light. God bless you, sir. So, guys, it's great. I'll see you here at shockonow.net. Click right below here to get all your free goodies. I love you guys. More people are coming to truth in Jesus Christ. Game over, atheism. Game over.